as we enter the, the San Pedro National Forest, we can clearly tell it is a totally different game around here. First time we see such big trees, birch trees from the border. I really feel that the desert now is behind us and, and we're changing the biotop. Totally different. New ecosystem. I love feeling those those movements. Being able to feel that in a 30 mile stretch, not even 20 mile stretch, just with my legs and my lungs. This is why through hiking is so great. This is why it is so cool to through hike, even when you're post awning. So, we, I wasn't expecting snow that early on the, P, on the CDT, but I'm still for a good week in New Mexico. But if I have to exit earlier to go and pick my winter gear to be able to walk or ski actually safer in that area, I will do it. But this is amazing. I'm, I'm very, very happy to see my landscape changing and going into mountains. I love the desert section of Mexico. It was fantastic. The little change will make spice in my life. By the way, this, it's another fantastic day on the CDT. First 15 minutes in the snow, I didn't follow the right river. 20 minutes for nothing. Well done, Dorian. Do you need a help? Right. Chef menu is roasted potato, a bit of um, bacon, and some chilies, some corn. And we're here in a fantastic restaurant. We found a little place. And there is snow everywhere. <laughs> but man, building that fire is magic. Yeah, it's amazing. <laughs> what do you think about that? It's very cold. <laughs> I'm very happy that the summing's coming out. I put the socks on my hand and I'm ready to go.
Look at that. An apple on the trail. It's nice trail magic from Meg. <laughs> <laughs> bon voyage. <laughs> Merci, Meg. <laughs> so, Meg is in charge of creating a new CDT on that, on that, um, exactly that trail, actually. <laughs> bon voyage. Merci. I need to work on my friend. Wow. I found a little stream to have a shower. It felt so good. Uh, it's weird, but we started in the snow early morning, but it was uh, pretty warm this afternoon, so uh, I sweated. And I'm waiting my friends having dinner at the same time, so I'll show you what's for dinner. Then an avocado. Mm, was in town not a long time ago. Rice will be mixed with um, tuna. Lemon pepper is always my favorite. And some... Chili, mm, green chili, well, red and orange chili, it be great. And for dessert, because there is no way that a weekend finish a meal without the desert, a Cracker Jack. So I'm here in Ghost Ranch and I'm sorting out my food that I sent in to me. And like the previous time, I'm hoping for my bread. Look at that nice color bread. Mm. Do someone want a piece of bread? I can give it for free to anyone. Yeah, that wasn't a long conservancy bread. So when you're dumb, you learn it the hard way. Anyway, there is other stuff to heat here. That's so good. cool it's flat but it is a sad day I just broke my hiking pole so now I have no pole to set up my tent so tonight will be an interesting night if Rain is forecasted and I don't know how I'm going to um, set up my tent. But it makes the adventure very enjoyable. I've got 8 hours and 25 miles to figure out the solution. very complicated to go across yesterday because the, the log was almost entirely submerged the, uh, the end part so we waited overnight to be able to go across today uh, but unfortunately this morning the log is all frozen so that's why we're struggling that much to go across that log so Mercury kept his clothes on, but I I was pretty much naked. <laughs> hey, 
is kind of cute. <laughs> this is Luke and his beast car that gave us a ride to avoid the bad weather that's coming. My skis! Oh, I got my skis! <laughs> and my back from Six Moon Design. Thank you. I'm ready to go. Ready to head into the snow. Well, I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> the jukebox. Birds, birds, birds. The ring of fire. The ring of fire.